This is an article from WebMD.com on how to understand the difference between cons and calluses. What is a con? What is a callus? Cons and calluses can be annoying, but your body actually forms them to protect sensitive skin. Cons and calluses are often confused with one another. Cons generally occur on the tops and sides of the toes. A hard con is a small patch of thickened, dead skin with a packed center. A soft con has a much thinner surface and usually occurs between the fourth and fifth toes. A seed con is a tiny, discrete callus that can be very tender if it's on a weight-bearing part of the foot. Seed corns tend to occur on the bottom of the feet, and some doctors believe this condition is caused by plugged sweat ducts. Calluses can develop on hands, feet, or anywhere there's repeated friction, even a violinist's chin. Like corns, calluses have several variants. The common callus usually occurs when there's been a lot of rubbing against the hands or feet. A plantar callus is found on the bottom of the foot. What causes corns and calluses? Some corns and calluses on the feet develop from an improper walking motion, but most are caused by ill-fitting shoes. High-heeled shoes are the worst offenders, and that's why I don't let mother wear them, because they're sinful too. They put pressure on the toes and make women four times as likely as men to have foot problems. Other risk factors for developing a con or a callus include foot deformities and wearing shoes or sandals without socks, which leads to friction on the feet. Rubbing or pressure can cause either soft cons or plantar calluses. If you or your child develops a callus that has no clear source of pressure, have it looked at by a doctor since it could be a wart or caused by a foreign body like a splinter trapped underneath the skin. Feet spend most of their time in a closed, moist environment ideal for breeding bacteria. Staph infections can start when bacteria enter cons through breaks in the skin and cause the infected con to release fluid or pus. Ain't that some friggin' gross. This has been WebMD.com's article on how to understand the difference between cons and calluses. Thank you and have a good day.